Hi, Chris. My name is Ali. I'm in grade nine, and my question is, how long does it take to orbit Earth? Ali, it depends how far away you are. If you think about the Earth orbiting the sun, it takes us 365 and, and a quarter days. 364 and a quarter days? Anyway, one year, uh, plus a leap year every four. And uh, so that's because we're, whatever, 93 million miles from the sun. The moon takes one month to go around the world because it's 400,000 kilometers away. But sort of like a ball on a string, on a long, long string, you can spin it fairly slowly and the ball will stay up. But if it's a little short string, you have to spin it really fast or the ball will fall down. Sort of the same idea in orbit. Because the moon's a long ways away, it goes around the world about once a month. But the space station is much closer. And we have to go, if we have to go around the world every hour and a half. And d our exact altitude here, about 400 kilometers, means we have to orbit the world every 92 minutes. If we were a little further away, we'd go around the world more slowly. If we were closer, we'd have to go around faster. And one last thing, there's one orbit in between the moon that takes a month and the space station, which takes an hour and a half. There is an orbit where it takes exactly 24 hours to go around the world, if you think about it, right? One month, 90 minutes. There's some orbit, some distance, exactly 24 hours. So if you can orbit at exactly 24 hours around, that means you'll stay above the same place on the Earth because the Earth is 24 hours to turn around. It's a really valuable orbit for a satellite because you can bounce your signal off it all day. And that's how I'm talking to you, in fact, off one of those satellites. But for us, 92 minutes once around, 16 times a day.